people welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you all are doing fabulous today's video we're going to be talking about why so many ladies mistake material things for love i've seen this happen a lot and i know you've seen it too let's discuss i'll share my views and you share your views in the comment section below okay let's get into the video I was going through some questions that I received and I noticed that a lot of girls mistake material things for um, love you know they say that somebody asked me saying you know he's never sent me this he's never done this for me he's never done that for me doesn't mean he really loves me or maybe he's just you know maybe he's stingy or anything like that see him Material things you can get material things for, from somebody even if they don't love you You can get material things from somebody if they want to get something from you Love is another ball game. It's a different thing. You understand me? Somebody can be able to spoil you silly, but they don't feel anything about you The only thing they because the only thing you, you, you're able to offer is your body and then in exchange for your body What they give you is money. That is it. So this whole norm of um, trying to figure out if, you, if your partner loves you just because of how much he spends on you needs to come to an end Because if you have this mentality in your head, you're in for a very long You know long line of disappointment. You understand me? When you meet a partner You have to meet somebody you have to you know you, you have to be in a relationship with somebody that you're able to relate with You understand? Me? It's a ship. You're supposed to be able to relate to that person and then that person has to get to know you on a deeper level to understand you to love you for who you really are you know um if you focus mostly on what you can get out of that person if your partner is not able to give you that particular thing that you want you know you're going to be disappointed and you start jumping from one relationship to the next one relationship to the next hoping that you're going to find somebody that will be able to spoil you this is when you you end up with somebody that is toxic you understand me they'll hit you and they'll give you money and you'll be like okay my problems are solved they'll, they'll do this to you they'll belittle you they'll do any you know because they know that the only thing this girl wants is money if i spoil her with money i can do anything that i want to do with her i can control her I can, and you'll never be happy you understand me so I understand that money is important okay it's it's a daily need we go to school so that we get good jobs and get money but then you you should also find a companion okay somebody you're able to confide in somebody that is able to trust you you know somebody that even if the world turns their back on you he will always be there for you do you understand me young ladies have to stop um looking for who's going to you know who's he, he did not send me money. He did not send me. I asked for this one. He did not send it. I, I asked for this one. People work for their money and they budget for that money. So if you're not in their budget, that budget at that particular time, it doesn't mean they do not like you. It just means that they have important things to do. Yeah, his girlfriend. You're not yet his wife. So you're not solely his responsibility. Sure, you understand me. So what I'm trying to say is, you have to stop this. Um, trying to get something out of every man that dates you because men are going to take advantage of you and some people don't like women that are constantly begging because you become a liability if you become a liability it is stress it is added stress on top of the stress that that person already has you are added stress so it's better they leave you and go for somebody that is mature in their head somebody that is able to also you know put this on put put this on i'll put this one there Oh yeah okay you can do this for yourself i'll be able to get data for myself you know he's not supposed to be you know he, he think about your data he think about your hair you think about this what are you going to be thinking of you yourself what are you going to do for yourself you know you end up becoming a liability and then you're going to still, you, you end up saying oh every man that comes my way only wants to use me for my body because that's the only thing you have to offer you can't ask about his growth you can't ask about investments you can't ask about his future plans you can't ask about um where he's going to go five years from now you understand me so you have that norm of that norm in your head that says a man is the only way that a man shows love is 
by how much he's able to provide for me needs to come to an end. Only then will you be able to find true love. Okay? I hope this gets you in good health. Um, thank you so much for coming to the end with me. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.